The most interesting thing about out there is every day is different. Every, every school you go to, there's always something new. Some of them had their preconceived ideas because we're from the Australian ballet and they take that as we're doing a classical ballet class. As the workshop goes along, you can see that their minds are starting to change and that they're really enjoying themselves. The strongest impressions that I'm left with is the indelible smiles on the children's faces, you know, that you would literally have to just peel them away. They are so focused, they've been energised. Obviously that's feeding off the energy of the dancers and their passion, they can see that. Three, four, and grow. Backwards, straight, swish. Again. Backwards, straight, swish. And vertical. Vertical line all the way up to the... Once it gets to the dance part of the workshop, they're all really excited about using the rhythms and inventing their own movements. You can actually see the transformation between the start and the end. And one more time and go. I started dance when I was 10 years old. We do three workshops usually in a day and then at the end we do talking doing dances for them. You can see they're clicking and you're like, oh yeah, we did that during the workshops. And yeah, it's nice to see that recognition. For most of our children, they haven't had the opportunity to see that sort of ballet activity. So when they see performers like metres away from them, they're blown away by that. And I'd love to see some of our children go on and do it simply for pleasure, but if they achieved greater heights, that would be fantastic. It looks really nice. It takes a lot of strength, and I'd like to try it sometime, because it tells really nice stories. When the kids see what we do, and they think, oh, okay, so that's ballet, and some of them at the end come up and say, I want to start ballet now, and you feel like you've done something. <laughs>